Orient Express. Hey. It's not crash. Oh well. Ow. Yep. We get to play as Coco in this game. Although I don't think she has any speaking role in this game at all. In fact, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Meet Puda. Or Pura. I don't know why I put called him Puda. Yes, Pura is a guy. A lot of people think that Pura is a girl. So Pura is basically the polar of this game, as polar is not in this game, except for in the beginning when you saw him. All right? Do not go on that. That will bounce you up. Much like always, these ones will most likely be filled with suicides. I'm going to try to avoid two, to be quite honest. I am going off memory here. Alright, there we go. Nope, suicide. First suicide of the project. There we go. Boing. Alright. There is also a dash in this one. I believe it is the same one that it is from the first... From the second game that introduced this sort of thing. I'm gonna not hit it because I don't want to accidentally get myself killed. Which is pretty understandable. Alright. Ah! Oh, gotta kill myself. It's so sad when the only deaths inside that have gone for the project right now are suicides. But sometimes these things happen, right? I mean, these things happen. Now, I find that it's easier to control Pura than it is to control Polar, in that I will go to the uh, left and right really, really easily. Did I get them all? Yes, I did. There we go. And this time... Aww. <laughs> yep, Coco can jump, but she can't spin, but... I want to take the kitty with me. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Not the last time we're going to see the kitty, though. No worries. And I won't abuse the kitty. I love kitty. <laughs> She's just like, oh, that was easy. Yeah, it was so easy. That's why you died. Oh no, crash dance? Oh well.